I would just say, stay tuned. The day of reckoning will come. The record will be straight. Why not set the record straight now? I mean, what is it about the record that's not straight? <laughs> stay tuned. Can I say something? I feel like I have insulted one pizza chain more than any other pizza chain for the last decade. And without a doubt, it's been Papa John's. I've said that um, the dough is too sweet. It's too chewy. It's unbecoming of a pizza, even a, a major chain pizza. In the last six weeks or so, I've ordered... I, I had to change my normal pizza place because I was worried that my old pizza place was what gave me food poisoning. Maybe yes, maybe no, you know? I'm just, I, I'm changing variables that I have the ability to change. So I started ordering from Papa John's because I found a coupon online that never fails. And uh, it, it gives you 25% off of every order. I thought maybe you could only use it once, but uh, apparently it's like an idiot tax to not Google Papa John's Canada... Uh, reward code. I'm not going to share it. I don't know if it's like specific to the location that's right above my house. <laughs> the one that I got in my basement. I can't share that. You can't trick me. I've been around the block a couple times. Anyway, I got um, the Garden Fresh pizza. And I said, this is the Papa John's I remember and I detest it. I said, we'll run it back one time because my daughter enjoyed their pepperoni pizza. I got a more traditional, you know, tomato sauce, um, cheese, processed pork, couple of vegetables on top of it. I was, it's pretty good, man. Certainly not the best pizza I've ever had in my entire life. That would be ridiculous. But way, way, I thought it was actually like a three out of 10. And it's actually like a six. I just want to apologize to the, the franchise. Oh, come on, a six? I think a six is pretty good. That is pretty fair. No, I will not apologize to John. That's just not going to happen. Better than Mod Pizza? It's tough to say. I would say the pizza at Domino's tastes a little bit better than Mod Pizza. But the thing is, it also um, takes 35 minutes to, to make and get to my house. Whereas if you're at a mod pizza, it takes three minutes for the pizza to come out of the oven. So I would, me personally, I would go mod pizza on that one. But Papa John's has, has at least elevated itself out of the, the pizza basement. And I hate to say it. I mean, this is just personal preference. I'm not like the pizza guy. If you had asked me three months ago, man, maybe six months ago, what's better? Domino's or Papa John's, I would have said like 15 years ago, maybe Papa John's clears. But now ever since Domino did the new recipes in like 2008, they've been a lot better. Having had Domino's recently and having had Papa John's recently, Papa John's clears. Now, two pizzas from Domino's is like $11.99, which is fucked up. That's fucking crazy. That's so cheap. Two pizzas from Papa John's probably take you up. Canadian probably takes you 26, 30 bucks, something like that. But Domino's is scary. By the way, anyone see Maestro on Netflix yet? I just want to know. I want to look at the accounting. I want to look at the books. I need to know Maestro's cigarette budget. I think that they smoke $1,000 worth of cigarettes in every single scene. There is never a scene in the... And this is irrespective of the quality of the movie, which I have not finished yet, but I'm enjoying. They... There's no scene where any character is not smoking all the time. It's crazy, bro. Is smoking coming back? Well, the movie takes place in like 1944 <laughs> when they were healthy. Is it possible? I'm not saying yes. Is it possible the air pollution was so bad back then that smoking cigarettes was actually better for you than breathing the air? Air pollution's way worse now. Have you ever seen a movie that takes place in London in like 1891? The sky looks like the Matrix. And I'm not talking about when they're in the Matrix. I'm talking about when Morpheus shows uh, Neo what the future looks like, which is actually the present. <clears throat> I do have to say the Matrix got one thing right, though. I think if the machines ever take over and then they choose like a time period for mankind to live in contentment, 1999 is going to be the way, man. They were right about that one. 
No one looking at their phones, just living in the moment. Oh, you know what? We should bandle. We should bandle. Everyone was afraid of Y2K back then. I wouldn't say everyone was afraid of Y2K. What I would say, for me personally, I would say my experience in life is that basically from the time you're like 12 onwards, you're always going to be afraid of something. You might as well be afraid of something that's not actually going to come true. Ooh. Bird necessities, that's not a Christmas song, I think. I don't know what it is. 1945, 20 million views. Piano. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And you can do that when you're in town. That's, um... In the manor we can build a snowman And pretend that he is Parson Brown We'll say, hey, 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 no man You could do the job while you're in town Have a holly jolly Christmas It's not holly jolly Christmas? A sleigh ride? It's not a sleigh ride, skip me Give me the next one Frosty the Snowman Give me the harmonies, please. Best time of the year. Say hello to friends you know and get a box of cheer. Have a holly, have a holly, have a little faith in me by John Hyatt. I don't think it has anything to do with a hotel, brother. Give me the voice cover. The weather outside is fucking frightful. Let it snow, bro. Oh. oh, that's my bad. Every Christmas song sounds so distinct from every other one that, like, uh, it's easy to tell them apart. I do like that they got the they got the Wurlitzer going for that. If they ever make a Napoleon Dynamite Christmas special. This is track one. Pedro and Deb get married at the local bowling alley in Manitowoc County, Wisconsin. NL, they don't live in Manitowoc County, Wisconsin. I know, they live in uh, Idaho. It's a destination wedding. Plus two, plus two, plus two. Minnesotans be like, thank you for owning Wisconsin. Well, um, not as bad as you got owned by the 76ers last night. Uh, my daughter fell asleep on top of me, so uh, I couldn't move. I was forced to watch an entire 80-minute basketball game. But I got to say, man, who? Tyrese Maxey went off, bro. I thought that, uh, first off, I've been calling him Joel Embiid for his entire career. It turns out, first basketball game I've ever watched, it's Joel. My mistake, I didn't realize. I thought the 76ers were basically just Embiid. It turns out they got this other guy too. Tyrese Maxey, dude dropped like 38 points or something. Would you pay, play Jackbox with Jack Black? Of course. He's gotta be one of the only <clears throat> celebrities that I think I would be excited to play Jackbox with. Almost every other one I think would be a, a nightmare. At least 90... I would say 95% plus of celebrities I could name, I think it would be bad to play Jackbox with them. I think they would either be uh, not funny or they would be so concerned about accidentally like desecrating their public image that it would, it would be uncomfortable. Which is their right for the record, but that's why I wouldn't want them to be in the lobby in the first place. Jack Black, I think he's, he's one of the comedians where I think if he were to say, I'm gonna stop swearing, I would be like, this guy's still gonna find a way to be funny. It's crazy that Jack Black is like one of the most wholesome celebrities I can think of when like Tenacious D's first album is full of songs like, you know, Double Team, Fuck Her Gently, etc., etc. But like, I don't think he's like re rehabilitated like a, a, a horny image. He's just like, he's just been authentic to himself the whole time. 
Is he Reddit's next darling? Are you traveling here in a time machine from like the year 2004? He has been a, uh, a darling on Reddit and elsewhere since, since he burst onto the damn scene in like 1998. Now, Jack Black movies, he has a few that are really good for sure, but some of them, I like them, but a lot of people find them a little hit or miss. And whatever he's in, maybe this is like a psyop, but when he's in something bad, I'm never like, oh, this movie sucked because Jack Black was in it. I'm, I'm always like, it, that movie sucked in spite of Jack Black being in it. Hello. Can you look at style so cute, honey. You picked your own bow? And then I tied her hair like a magical girl. You do look like a magical girl. Do you want to play the no game? Yeah. Oh, you won already. She didn't find that as funny as I did. How are you feeling this morning, honey? I'm just this You're watching me play this game? Yeah. I don't know if it's a great idea. It's a little gross. You like when I play this game? You know, when you were like a little baby, you used to sleep in your crib behind daddy and daddy yeah. would play this game and talk into this microphone. <laughs> it's true. So pretty. Mm -hmm. You look so pretty today. Wow, I like your blue bow. Oh, it has like a little shoe on the bow. Yeah, it's because it's Cinderella. Oh, it's a Cinderella bow. You gonna put it on my chair? You wanna put it in daddy's hair? Ah. <laughs> oh, I see. It's a bracelet, too, like Mommy said. You go up? Yeah. What are you going to have for breakfast? Oh. I'll see you after the work is done, honey. See you this afternoon. She's been a little emotional um, while she's been sick. Also, she's a big uh, Minnesota Timberwolves fan, so she was not, uh, she wasn't stoked about yesterday's game. I mean, brother, I just, listen, I got nothing against Anthony Edwards, but why, he's eating shots from like really, really low confidence areas. You gotta play the cycle a little bit more than that, man. Do not let her see Brazilian Timberwolves Twitter. True, though, true. Dude had to choose that game to watch. Yeah, I know you're like number one in the West or something like that, but I mean, like, you couldn't come up with a way to stop uh, Tyrese Maxey. The dude is like the shortest dude on the basketball court. He was probably like, what, six foot seven? <laughs> Rudy Gobert is eight foot four. You couldn't figure out how to stop him. All Rudy Gobert knows how to do is use his freakish wingspan to go like this and go, what, 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 what? After he clearly fouls someone in the paint. Like I thought the dude was, was the defensive player of the year. Watching him flop around on the court. Honestly, I was offended. He should be the offensive player of the year in my personal opinion. Plus he started the pandemic. I think my, my brain is beginning to rot. I had a dream about DL Guiga. Can I just say, that was a message I read in chat. That's not a message that came from my brain. That's crazy, bro. How could, you had a dream about DL Guiga? Are you in the Peloton? I didn't see the username of the person who, who stated that. Are you in the Peloton group or are you just watching too much content? Because if you're not in the Peloton group, that's like, you need a tolerance break. I think you need to smoke more weed so you stop dreaming. People go to the Peloton board just to see the activity on the Discord. It is crazy. We must be like the only streamer Discord. I mean, it's, I don't mean this to be rude. I just think like it's it's genuinely true. We got to be the only streamer Discord where the most popular channel in the Discord is the exercise channel. It actually gets like 5x the chat activity than any other channel on the entire server. It's crazy. Like, what, what about Misk? It, Misk gets like a hundred messages a day. Hashtag Peloton gets like, I don't even, it probably gets like a couple thousand. Peloton users are kind of psychotic. No, not really. I wouldn't say at all, to be honest. 
They do use Peloton as a misc. I mean, people are out there giving each other, like, employment advice. I guess, you know what, it's the only part of the Discord where people are allowed to talk. <laughs> That's probably it. Because if you try to talk, if, if the conversation starts in Twitch about a stream, and then it deviates, uh, like, in, like conversations normally do, right? Like it deviates into another topic, the mods shut it down instantly. They're like, this is not a, a conversation about Twitch, please take it to MISC. And I could just, whenever I get told to take it to MISC, I'm like, I'm not taking it to MISC, it's freaking dead in there. Like, I shouldn't even be talking in the Discord to begin with. Like, you really think I'm going to go over to another channel and be like, oh, so as I was saying, like, no, I'm going to take this opportunity to go do something else. I'm not insulting Origin. They'd run a tight ship. I'm glad. Like, we, again, we shouldn't be having the conversations there to begin with. I made the Discord so people wouldn't talk. I know that sounds crazy, but it's true. It's the knowledge that people are going to talk anyway. They might as well talk in an environment that I have some awareness of. And as a result, we can control the moderation standards. Yeah. You're going to you're going to do a solo Costco trip? Yeah. Without me? Yeah. All right. Yeah, no, that's fine. Is it, it's actually better. I've just if anything, I'm actually proud because I think like six months ago, you would have been like, I'm not sure I'm ready for that. But now you got the skills. <laughs> do I need anything from Costco? All right, I, I do. I need... You're not going to be happy. <laughs> I need Stoke Cold Brew. Just one two pack is fine. And I do need uh, a, a 30 rack of Coke Zero. The last time we bought was two weeks ago. It's on schedule. That's why I said, she said I can't move that. And that's why I said you're not going to be happy. <laughs> okay, that's fine. No, no, no. This, just the Stoke is fine. I can, uh, I'll fulfill my Coke Zero need from another store that I'll go to. No, 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 don't, don't risk it. Um, like 12, no, 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 it's 355 milliliters times 30. So it's, I don't know, quick maths. I don't know, I've just literally told my brain not to do it. <laughs> Here, one second. It's three, so it's like 10 liters. So it would be like, uh, yeah, 10 kilos. I don't know. Yeah, the cans also have some, some weight to them, I suppose. Don't I feel disgust? Not really. <laughs> I feel disgusted every time I eat those uh, TGI Friday's potato skins out of the freezer because I've got no other food right now. That, I feel disgusted over that. I don't feel that disgusted over drinking two Coke Zeros a day. Wait till you find out what's in your bubble tea, sweetheart. I don't drink two a day. Yeah, you're lucky for that. Well, she's right. She's saying she'd rather have two bubble teas a day, which is... I think most people would probably plus two you on that one, quite frankly. What should I buy for myself from Costco? I have a $250 gift card. That's easy. Half the gift card, burn it on uh, a year's executive membership. The other half of the gift card, 82 hot dogs. Dude, my blood pressure got so high the month my wife went away. All I ate were Costco hot dogs. I had to go to the hospital. Okay, <laughs> don't do that. I definitely, I feel like a hot, a Costco hot dog is a once a week at maximum sort of thing. I, all, all men, I think, have to go through this journey of discovery. Just because you can do more doesn't mean you should. In fact, most of the time, it actually means you shouldn't. And I think that goes for like almost every vice that you can think of. Maybe every other day? No, once a week. On average, like I'm not saying if you have two Costco hot dogs in a week, like you're going to die. But if you average two a week, my two cents is that like that's not great. If you average one a week, that means you have two a week sometimes. And then maybe you don't have one next week because things just get, uh, you know, you, you don't find yourself going to the Costco. It is insanely cheap, though. You, like you almost can't afford not to eat them every time you're there. 
Like, it's insane that not everybody who works at Costco is dead. Because I would probably be dead if I worked there. You know the restraint it would take to work at Costco and pack your own lunch every day? Knowing that the lunch that you're making is costing you more than it would cost you to buy your lunch at work? You're really gonna spend like seven bucks on ingredients to bring a salad to work when you could get a, a hot dog and a soda for a buck fifty? I would be dead. I would keep it going for like a month probably. I'd be like, yeah, no, no, no. It's really nice to have these salads. You know, it keeps me going all day. Then like I'd get a little bit busy and then I'd be like, oh, this week I'll just have like a hot dog once or twice. And then like a month later, I would be in the hospital for sure. Origin just said in Discord he got banned from Twitch. What happened? Hang on. Wait a second here. I'm scrolling down. Uh, did they? This is a trap. I did. What happened? Oh, because <laughs> when you were talking about people <laughs> in the Discord going off topic, you said, yeah, I'll kill them. Twitch auto mod went like, yeet, that's a death threat and, and kicked you off the platform. <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna accept your appeal, okay? I hope you wrote something in the mitigating circumstances that was like, in context, this actually wasn't a death threat, okay? I, if, if they decline it, I'll send them a message. <laughs> like, there's a good lesson to learn there. I know Talia got banned once because they wrote, I am 14 years old in chat or something, or I am 12 years old. Listen, I, I'm, I'm being serious. If they don't get back to you, I'll, I'll talk to my partner rep and be like, can we please unban this person? Yes, don't do, don't type it, because it's not a person, it's an AI. They'll just, they'll ban you and you'll be gone for like three weeks. You'll be like, ha 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 ha, and then like in, for three weeks, you'll be like, I can't type anything, this is boring. Okay, so this is, this is awkward for me to do because my partner rep has sent me like eight messages that I haven't replied to over the past several months, but this is, this is what it means to be a good person, okay? Let me just find, there it is right there. Hey, sorry I haven't replied to these, colon, sweat, smile. No, you might not be in office right now, but <laughs> I wanted to drop a line just to say one of my trusted Mods got banned um, for typing, I would kill them as a joke. It wasn't a death threat, but I can see how the um, moderation settings might interpret it as one. Uh, and I was wondering if we, if I could possibly put in a good word for them to get unbanned. Sweat. Smile. Sorry for the holiday message. There you go. That's the first minute and a half of the YouTube video. <laughs> Send tweet. Sincerely. What a message. That's how I write messages to, to like my strangers. My strangers? That's how I write messages to strangers. Or at least people that I'm only like an acquaintance with. When I'm a friend with someone, here's what I, I said to the Unity Discord this morning. I said, trade offer. You receive a Jackbox lobby at roughly noon Pacific. I receive your company. That's how I talk to, to people I have rapport with. Hey, CD Viking, good rides. And, uh... Thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. What's sweat smile? Sweat smile is an emoji of a face sweating, but also smiling. Where it's like, I'm stressed, but like I'm in a good mood, you know? Or it's like, I'm embarrassed that I have to say this to you, but I really need a favor. I, dude, I, sweat smile is actually the emoji that sold me on emojis having utility. Before that, I was just like, I don't need an emoji to tell people I'm happy. Like, I'll just write a message that carries that tone. But sweat smile is like, it's hard to convey that in words in like an elegant way. 
An elegant walk. Uh, yeah, yeah, I saw the ugly. I saw emojis were invented in 1999, okay? We're all very, we're proud of you that you know the date of the invention of emojis and definitely did not just Google when were em emojis invented 15 seconds ago. We're all very impressed, okay? Here's that attention you ordered. <laughs> Sorry. Sweat smile. Sorry for all that fucked up stuff I said. Uh, sweat smile. I was under a lot of stress. One of my mods got banned. Sweat smile. I'm not embarrassed to say I use OK Hand all the time. Here's my perception on OK Hand. I used to use it a lot. I used that and thumbs up. And then people started to say that it was like, um, like a dog whistle for being a racist. So I stopped using it for like, I don't know, five years. And then people started to make think pieces that were like, according to Gen Z, the thumbs up is uh, passive aggressive. So then I went back to OK Hand and I just don't use it racistly. And then if I, if I did it in public and then someone came over to me and is like, we're going to do racism together, I would be like, you got the wrong guy. Thumbs up is not passive aggressive, okay? That's, I'm going to battle Gen Z on this one. If they want to see it as passive aggressive, that's fine. But it's not passive aggressive. It's a unit, well, maybe not universal, but it's a very commonly understood nonverbal gesture to indicate one's contentment with the situation. Like, do you think Siskel and Ebert were negging movies when they gave them two thumbs up? No, bro. They were saying, you know, go see Billy Madison in theaters this Friday. To Gen Z, a thumb up is basically like if someone replies to your text with K. Okay, that is really bad as a millennial. K is basically like they sent me a thumbs down. So I don't know how that can be the same as a thumbs up. What about KK? That's millennial, like ICQ for like nice K. That's like, I want to say okay, but not passive aggressively. So I say KK. I, I lived through this. I went through the trenches with this. It's like if someone messages you, hey, H-E-Y in 2003, you're about to have a serious conversation. If someone messages you, hey, with like three Y's, they got a crush on you. <laughs> and don't even get me started on four or more Y's. Like, I don't even know what happened. It's, I, I should be so lucky to have that happen to me at some point in my life. Yeah, with like the, the, the lips emoticon. Like a hey, and then the, the bright red lips at the end of it. Old people don't understand emojis as well. I think that's true. I mean, nor should they. I mean, they were only invented in 1999, as you know. Um, my mom sends me like the, the bitmojis sometimes. Like the ones, like it's, it's an emoji, but I, it's been handcrafted to kind of like look like my mom. And it really does look like my mom, which is why it's like more unsettling. Like I don't know what it is that is like way more unsettling to get a, a cartoon image of your mom giving a thumbs up instead of just the default thumbs up. Like, mom, I know who's sending the thumbs up. It has your name like at the top of the text conversation. It's like, imagine if you took it one step further and you sent like a picture of yourself doing the emote instead of the, the emoji. You would be like, what are you doing? This is crazy. But for some reason, we accept Bitmoji. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. I'm not mad at my mom for it. It's just, you know, a, a generational sort of difference. More power to her. I mean, like, if anything, I'm kind of impressed. I don't even know where, like, I would make a Bitmoji, but she's got that on lock. <laughs> Can you imagine if Twitch was like that? Dude, yeah, if you tell, like, a, a really bad joke and then you just see, like, a bunch of people's selfies with the I can't face. Oh, man. This, the internet was, like... It's only 2% different from what the internet is actually like, but it would change things dramatically. First time chatter? Does this streamer ever talk about the game? You must be new here. Most astute Twitch streamer, you must be new here. It's rare to witness a, a type A chatter being born. Lightning crashes, a moderator dies. 
the confusion levels heads and goes down the new the new chatter down the hall. Oh, my streamers ranting once again. You know what I'm saying? Live lightning crashes. Like a rumble streamer chasing a trend. I don't really know what he says in the song. But I do know that lightning crashes and... Uh, the new mother cries. The confusion levels heads. It was so, the confusion is a doobie level in heads. See the glory of the high, high. Something like that. He does say fetus in that song, doesn't he? Lightning crashes lyrics. <clears throat> fetus. Oh, yeah. The fetus opens her eyes. The confusion sets in <laughs> and gives birth to the fetus down the hall. Oh, my fetus coming, setting in again like confusion, thunder leveling heads. Put the fetus at the center of the setting in. I know what you're saying. That's, dude, that's a classic from the 90s. That's a 90s classic, without a doubt. Pale blue colored eyes. Confusion sets in. They're the angel down the hall. That was more like Elvis, but you get the idea. What if Elvis sang Lightning Crashes? Oh, my feet. It sounds exactly the same. Come here back again. Is it true that Ronald Reagan's last words were, I'm from Ohio, bitch? Or is that like a Call of Duty uh, Cold War thing? Is both real and from Call of Duty? Did you see the, um... There was like a tweet that was like, here's the most searched video games on pornographic websites. And then it compared them to like the trend from a year ago. That was blowing my mind. So like, I don't know, number one was like Overwatch and then like all the Genshin Impact games were in there as well. But it was, the thing that I found most degenerate and there's like a lot to choose from, was Call of Duty was like number 13 or something like that. Who the fuck is Google, or not Googling, but searching Call of Duty not safe for work on a pornographic website. Like, that's insanity. Like, I just, it, it never struck me at all that you would be playing those games and be like, you know what, I'm horny. Minecraft was in second place. <laughs> There's, that makes more sense to me, as crazy as it sounds. And I think, can I... There's, we can get to the distillation of my thought here. I know what you're gonna say is that's counterintuitive because Call of Duty is like semi-realistic and Minecraft is an abstraction. But having spent a lot of time on the internet and like you get tweeted insane things, you click on their profile. In a weird way, so there's like normie preferences. Those are normal. Let's establish our baseline. The second most normal thing is like an insane fetish. Like Bowser fucking Yoshi enormous penis on Sonic the Hedgehog. Like that, just by distribution in the population, that's like the second most normal, is like very weird. Then the weird thing is just slightly weirder than normal. Like Googling like Call of Duty big tits is so much weirder than like Bowsette goon material. And just using the dictionary definition of the word weird as like, you know, not represented in a majority of the population. Like a lot of you, and I don't mean this in a judgmental way, a lot of you have weird preferences. Preferences that, you know, you wouldn't have told anybody about in 2006. But now, in 2023, is like the whole identity on social media. And I love that for you. I got no problem with it. Just stop tweeting me, Hey, did you know Cine2 Nerdle came out with a battle mode? Yeah, I've been playing it for like a week straight. So in a way, your weirdness is actually not that weird, because there's a lot of weirdos. 
The real weird stuff is the people who are like, I'm mostly normal, but then I go home and Google Call of Duty big tits, which is just like an insane phrase to, to ever associate with your identity on any search engine ever. It's like, in a weird way, I think the, the biggest weirdos of all, and this is going to cause an argument in chat and I'm so ready for it. There's like people that jerk off to pornography. I'm going to go ahead and say it. That's normal. Then there's people who jerk off to like clothed photos of celebrities. That's fucking weird, bro. Like if you jerk off to porn, that's normal. If you jerk off to cartoons, I never thought I would say this. You got an ally on your team. That's normal. It's called hentai and it's art. But jerking off to like a red carpet photo of a Hollywood actress that's at the premiere of her movie is like, that's assault. <laughs> that's fucking strange to me, especially because the vi it's the gentleman boners thing again. So I apologize for the rehash. But I always feel like those people have like an air of like they're they're jerking off with like their pinkies up. Unlike you, I jerk off to softcore pornography. It's like people who are like, I like stand up comedians who don't swear because I have taste. The like, porn is gross. Instead, I jerk off to a photo of a lady who's fucking at work right now. You sicko. Like, what are you doing? She's just doing her job. It's obscene. This shit is disgusting. So are porn stars? Yeah, but that's their job, you know? Like when you go to McDonald's and you're like, I'll take a hamburger. They're like, we're McDonald's. That makes sense. When you walk into the fucking, you know, Walmart and you're like, make me a hamburger. You're like, bro, I'm stocking shelves right now. Can you not? You're weirding me out. What about whacking it to clothed photos of porn stars? I don't know. That's like... <laughs> I think you should respect their craft and look at a photo of them with their clothes off. Why? I don't know why it seems like more violating to pleasure yourself to a picture of a pornographic actor or actress with their clothes on than with their clothes off. <laughs> like you're not classy for jerking off to photos of like non-porn actresses who are just living their lives. Like, that's actually way creepier than Googling Call of Duty Big Tits. Call of Duty Big Naturals is funny. There's a lot to unpack there. Like, guy who wants AI-generated art, but only of natural breasts. They're like, no, 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 no. Sorry, sorry. Uh, Chat GPT, can you make those a little smaller? I don't like fake breasts. I want artificial Big Naturals. <laughs> that's a great phrase. Marvel, I, I mean, I haven't seen much Marvel stuff since 2020, but I will say, has it ever been more over than this? <laughs> they cast one actor as a million dudes. They were like, check it out. You know how we used to have a new villain in every movie? Now we're going to have the same villain in every movie. Uh, and then the movies weren't that good. And then the actor got convicted of domestic abuse. Ooh. I'm not saying they should have seen it coming. I don't think there's any way they could have seen it coming. But it's just like, uh, you got to hit him with, a, with an oof on that one. You got to hit him with a, a Gen Z passive aggressive thumbs up. But it could be worse though. It could be Aquaman. And the fucking Mages of the Mystic. What's the new one called? I'm sorry. <laughs> Could be Aquafina. I've got nothing against Aquafina because I've only seen her in like two movies. But I do picture her face every time I say, I don't know about all of that. I hate bottled water in general. It is crazy. I, I blame my generation for bottled water, by the way. We didn't invent it, but I think we were like big consumers. Every generation unleashes some evil or like, you know, allows some evil to thrive. Gen Z, you'll get there too. You're probably already there, but you just don't realize. It's probably TikTok if I had to guess. In like 10 years, 
if you're like 19 right now, you'll be like, remember when we used to like watch so much TikTok and make TikToks? Like that was, they shouldn't, somebody should have stepped in and stopped us from doing that. I don't know, maybe, maybe not. If you're like 50 and you're making TikToks, I mean, I was making them when I was 32. I do want to say in my own defense, 2020 was a wild year for everybody. <laughs> Cigarettes are back. Let's freaking go! Editor's note, you should never smoke cigarettes. Also, I don't smoke cigarettes. But I want to fit in. Let's freaking go! They are cool, though. The thing is, is that they're not. Like, there's... N <laughs> I don't want to... I don't think I'm bursting anybody's bubble. They kind of are. I don't think that... Well, if you're comparing them to vapes, yes, they're cooler than vapes because they taste bad. So that by all things that taste bad are cooler than things that taste good. That's just a given. I, I don't think they look swag at all. My most millennial trait is I am anti-cigarettes. I know people have been canceled for less in the modern era. Oh, please. I'm not putting on airs. All that anti-smoking propaganda worked on me where they were like, don't smoke. It's bad for you. You'll die. And also you'll spend a lot of money on something that doesn't really matter. It worked on me. I bought into the propaganda, man. It's not as expensive as weed. Yeah, well, I'm not like for legal reasons. If you live in the United States of America, I can't say that you should smoke weed instead because I'd like to come to your country at some point. Um, but wait, it doesn't make any fucking sense, bro. It's legal in like 22 states or something. The FBI should just be marking fools. I mean, they shouldn't be, but they could be. I guess if they had, I guess if it was a slow day at the FBI, they'd be like, okay, uh, boss, we don't have anything to do today. Okay, just fucking go to California, go to Colorado and arrest everybody. Can't, like, because it's federally illegal, right? I'm not saying they should. I'm just saying if they want us to respect laws. <laughs> anyway, sure, maybe weed is more expensive than cigarettes. I believe that that's probably true with no data to back it up. Weed does cost too much. I need to see like, uh, you know that graph of inflation where it's like, you know, the price of food since the year 2000 has gone up like 70%, but the price of flat screen TVs has gone down like 3000%. So if you don't think about it hard at all, it's kind of like it comes out in the wash as long as you're buying as many flat screens as groceries. They need to put weed on that because I feel like my friends, big brothers, when I was in like middle school, they were like, it's 10 bucks a gram. And then when I was in high school, it was 10 bucks a gram. And then when I was in college, it was 10 bucks a gram. And then I haven't really interfaced with it since. But like, I kind of thought that was, it was like the weed standard. I thought it was like, you know, one Bitcoin always equals one Bitcoin. One gram always equals $10. It still is. <laughs> That's crazy. And it's no matter where you live. I live in England and it's 10 pounds. Holy cow. 650 in New Zealand. You're really, they, they got you busting out quarters. They got you paying with, they, they're, you're giving them a $10 bill. They're, they're giving you three singles and two quarters back. That's crazy, man. To be fair, you don't just buy one gram. Yeah, but that's because like you guys are smoking more weed than has ever been smoked in the history of Earth. And I don't mean that in an offensive way. I'm just call I'm calling it like I see it. <laughs> like worldwide weed consumption must be up like, like 500% in the last 10 years. And that's crazy because demand has gone through the fucking roof. And the price apparently is still holding steady. DL Guiga, make it make sense. Doesn't this violate the Fama and French uh, five-factor model? I'm just talking shit, basically. Here we go. Sorry, I forgot you're on vacation. I buy 28 grams at a time. The fuck are you making like a, a, a cake? That's normal? I have to be honest with you. I think that's probably 5x my lifetime cannabis consumption. The other weed constant, and you guys don't want to hear it, is that in 2008, a gram could smoke out your entire house. And it didn't matter if you lived alone or you had seven roommates. 
a gram was exactly as much as you needed. And preferably it was in an old Ziploc bag. That's kind of still true. <laughs> the more things change, the more they stay the same. I don't know that much about weed these days. And I, I, I mean, like at this point, again, it would be good for my bottom line to lie and tell you that I smoke weed all the time. People would probably be dropping tons of gift subs. They'd be like, hell yeah, brother, me too. Sorry, I have to be honest. Ever, the only way I interface with it these days is like that lady who makes the TikToks of insane smoking contraptions always gets like tweeted into my feed and then people are like, whatever happened to just smoking weed? She's always got like a, like some kind of fucking circus contraption. Then she like pulls on a, a ripcord like zing and she's sitting in her car and it like bubbles up. And it goes, blah, 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 blah. She's got the doohickey. Hey, Tech923, thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Th I knew it. Hell yeah, brother. She's smoking the shit that made the Oompa's Loompa. Dr. House in the Wonkaverse be like, it's not Loompa's. I don't know where I'm going. Some of those will hit for somebody. That's fine. Plus two. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey, Librarian, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you, thank you. I don't think that Librarian gift subbed the lupus joke. I think that this is the slash marker for... NL discusses blanking on stream, and then like all the comments will be like, is this real? No, it was the lupus joke. Oh, okay. All right. Well, <laughs> like I said, I knew it would work on some people. Why are you okay with watching Twitch, but not okay with watching YouTube? It's an interesting question. I don't think it's a mean-spirited question. I think it's a, it's a curious one because there's something to tease apart there. It's the spirit of curiosity. It's two things that look the same and then figuring out what's actually the, the meaningful difference between them that leads to you treating them differently. I would say it feels like um, Twitch to me, going to Twitch is like, I ha you have to recognize, I do not sit down and go, I'm going to watch this stream or I'm going to sit down and watch this video. Um, it's always just something that happens to be on while I'm doing something else. Uh, and it's either like a distraction or like a little bit of entertainment, right? YouTube for me is cringe in that sense because like I'm actively seeking out the optimum content that I want to ignore while I'm making YouTube thumbnails or whatever. Whereas on Twitch, it's just like, oh, one of my friends is live or like someone that I enjoy watching is live. So it's kind of like, I'm not going into it that the, with the expectation that the content is actually good. <laughs> I'm not like, oh, this is what I want to watch. I'm like, this is on. I think it's, it, the way I would think about it is like, if you were, Let's say you had to do a bunch of paperwork every night. Let's say you had like 60 to 90 minutes of paperwork every night. You might be different than me. And you might say like, oh, I'm going to put on something on Netflix that I enjoy. And then like after your work is done, you'll be like, oh, I don't remember anything about what I just saw. Or you might say, let's just see what's on TV and I'll have that on in the background while I sign these forms. That's more what it's like for me. And then honestly, when I get time to sit down and actively watch something and focus on it, I would just rather watch a movie. It just, and it, I'm, I'm not trying to pit two bad bitches against one another, but I would rather like focus on a, a, an encapsulated piece of media that is like an hour and a half to three hours long. And I get like the whole experience after having gone through that then be like, okay, I'm gonna watch four episodes of like a television program that might get canceled after uh, two extra seasons or like, oh, the first six seasons are good, but the remaining 11 seasons are like, they, they really jumped the shark, but there's a couple of episodes in there that are like still solid. Now, I, and I'm not flexing being busy. It's actually like, it's taken me a long time to admit it. It's a bad habit. Part of the reason I'm busy is a refusal to delegate anything because I'm like cheap. 
<laughs> or a refusal to delegate much, at least. It's also like, you know, I could, I don't know. I've, I've resisted, and we're getting into, it's, I mean, this is why it's a good question to begin with. I've resisted the idea of like turning YouTube as a job into YouTube as a business. And I know that it sounds like they're the same, but like I think of me like a plumber, but I like really like doing the plumbing. People would say, it's stupid, man. In plumber years, I'm like 62 years old. Why are you still uh, doing the pipes yourself? Why are you still doing the purchasing? Why are you still getting the catalog out and uh, doing that stuff when instead you could hire like seven people that could do all the purchasing for you and they could do all like the easy jobs and then you could just be more like, you could handle the books and be like the plumber's consultant. And, and, but it's, it's because I don't want to be the guy who handles the books. I want to be the guy who handles the pipes. That's why I got into the, the plumbing business in the first place. So I would rather spend my time, it, it feels more valuable for me on a fulfillment level to spend my time making the videos and getting my hands in the dough and you know kneading it and putting letting it rest in the refrigerator for 30 minutes and then I put it in the oven instead of like going on a golf trip with the CEO of Bimbo International to figure out how to get the loaves in more stores worldwide. So if anything, it's actually a personal fault that I'm busy when I could probably structure my life in such a way to be a little bit less busy and then have more time to watch television. But I'm not there right now. So you see yourself as a craftsman. Unfortunately, yes. Despite the craft being the most um, hilarious possible medium. <laughs> yes. The most trash, valueless possible art you can create. Yes, I am a proud craftsman. And I am Brit. It's a doctor. I, I am Pagliacci type thing. And I love that for me. I embrace that. It's the, it's the comedy that makes life worth crying about, but also worth laughing about. It's that, that give and take, that push and pull that creates the tension which, uh, which moves the world. Pagliacci could never. Me watching Bozo the Clown. <clears throat> when you're not shilling, you're like the Rothko of streaming. What, isn't Rothko the guy who said the robots are going to kill us all? That's Roko. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I, I, I thought that was an Arcade Fire song. Oh, he's a painter. That explains why I don't know him. Yeah, although, to be honest with you, I would much rather see Rothko's Basilisk. You know what's great about this? I, the engineers honestly need to be taken down a peg. After all that discussion about, you know, what, what, what this job means to me and the fires of my loins, you know, what makes me take pride in this despite it being a, a hilarious thing to take pride in. Some people in chat were like, damn, that's interesting. I'm not saying deep, but that's interesting. And some people in chat are like, have you ever considered using handbrake to speed up your workflow a little bit? Engineers, be gone. You got, you got the salaries, you got the benefits, you got the respect from society. Stay out of this one. Take a humanities class, okay? Not every statement is an invitation to optimize. Some of it is just meant to be observed. And if you're a cop, you got to tell me. But if you're a cop, perhaps report it upon. Save this one for the... I was going to say the people who read books. And you're going to say, that's not fair. I've read 50 books this year. And I'm going to say, no, no, no. Not fantasy novels. I'm sorry. It had to be... <laughs> he will divide us. He will divide us. We love America. They count. They do count in a way. In a way, in a different way. They're definitely books. They're not not books. In what way do they not count? I don't know. Like, I don't want to get into it. Because I rely on STEM majors for my income. <laughs> so I should be nice. <sighs> Literary fiction, very valuable for developing empathy. You can definitely tell when someone's read a lot of Game of Thrones books because they're usually like very empathetic towards George R.R. R. Martin. They're usually not saying stuff like, uh, wow, I really hope this blank dude finishes the books before he has a heart attack and dies. They, they seem very empathetic. I'm not hating on readers. I'm just hating on mean people. If you're a nice person who reads and you're like, that's not fair, 
I'm not talking about you. You're, we're on the same team, okay? Ooh, as crisp as the summer sun. Why do you open your Coke can so weirdly? See, I this is true. Maybe two weeks ago, D.L. Guiga said he got into finance, but he used to be an engineer. And I told him, and it was great because he didn't get it, but the rest of us will get it. I told him, oh my God, that explains so much. Like in my head, there were disparate elements of D.L. Guiga's uh, personality. And when he said he used to be in engineering, they all snapped into place, like the final step of the Rubik's Cube solving algorithm. And now, when you say stuff like, why do you open your can of Coke so weirdly? I was like, I just chuckle to myself and I say, oh, D.L. Guiga. <laughs> Classic. It's not an insult, it's just, you know, I, I felt like I came in and know you better, man. I never worked as an engineer. It doesn't matter. The damage is done. I have to say your hating of engineers is so valid. You've got me wrong, friend. I don't hate engineers. I have an obligation to hold them to account because when engineers talk to each other, if they talk to each other and know other people for too long, which ends up happening a lot of the time, they keep the, the superiority complex like builds up too high. So we as humanities interfacing individuals and as a someone who got their degree in biology i'm pretty much like the most humanities of all the sciences pilled um it's our obligation to cut them down to size now and then because otherwise they just keep they keep drifting they just drift they, they, they get too high of an opinion of themselves learn to code motherfuckers now that the machines can code better than you <laughs> they cannot <laughs> they for sure can't cope. That's cope. Engineer voice. That's cope. No, they can't. I've tried. All right. Well, <laughs> one day. Bro, how can't a machine code? It's made of code. Like chat GPT is built in Python and you're like, hey, write me some shit in Python. And it's like, oh, uh, 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 I don't as a large language model. I don't have the what, do, what the fuck do you mean? My brother in Christ, you made the sandwich. <clears throat> D.L. Guiga says, I also take offense when people say software engineering is a form of engineering. Yes, I know you take offense. I know, I know. The, the, the ring, it has, it, they don't give software engineers the ring, right? That you tap on your desk when you're, you're drinking uh, at the corporate happy hour on Fridays to remind you that like bridges do collapse. You have a responsibility. You have a responsibility to update the Trello board with the new priorities According to the daily stand-up we did this morning, you have a somber responsibility to your clients to change the font from Arial to Times New Roman and break 17 other things on the app in the process. Fuck you, man. Dude, I gave up on Coscodal. Why? I got real mad at it yesterday because it was like, uh, it gave me a red arrow when it was $2 away. And I was like, what the fuck are you talking about, bro? Yeah. It's scale. Same with the, uh, like, the guess how much this property sold for one. Like, the more mm. expensive it is, the closer you have to be exact. It's percentage-based, was... Corey. It's percentage-based. Yeah. I was fucking nice. mad, dude. I was Easy. mad. You got got. Hey, chat, you ever, or uh, other streamers in the call, you ever have uh, one of your mods get global banned from Twitch because... We were talking about moderation standards on the Discord, and they typed, I'll kill them, as a joke. And then oh, no. <laughs> that is funny, Wait, though. Banned on Discord? No, they got banned on, uh, they typed it in Twitch chat as a joke, and they got globally banned from the website. Jesus oh, Christ. I, I did a little uh, hat tip to my partner manager, and I was like, hey, I don't know if you guys are still in the office right now, but... Um, <laughs> Yeah, Mr. Still is a partner manager. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had one. If we're going band for band, I've, I didn't, I've yeah, never no, had one. Fair. I had a few. Or I might have one, but they've never said anything to me. And I, think <laughs> I, I guess you have, have a have secret them. one, a stealth one. I think my last one quiet quit. I, I love that for them. Twitching. Yeah, me too. I'm happy for them. Man, it's a shame they're now working for Kick. <laughs> 
Wait, does the 95.5 extend to staff as well? Not funny. <laughs> Note to self, not, not funny. Not funny. Wait. Two no, online. I, was, I didn't even see it as a uh, joke. I thought that was real. Uh, I was like, holy shit, Ryan's got 95.5? What the <laughs> He's talking about kick. He's talking about kick. Dude, Kate, oh. it's so funny. Kate watches a lot of uh, Korean streamers on Twitch. So when Twitch announced Oops. that they're shutting down in Korea, yeah. like they've all been talking about what they're going to do, which is like mm -hmm. super fucked up, obviously. But uh -huh. she was telling me, she was like, apparently there's like this new website that's better than Twitch. And they oh, no. give they give the streamer like a 95.5 oh, split. No. And she was like, it's got like a one word name or something like that. And I was like, oh, you're talking about kick. And she's like, yeah, that's the one. Have you heard of it? And I was like, you're going to want to sit down bit. for this. <laughs> <laughs> it was like book, book one. Here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to keep it a, a, buck, a dollar and 50 cents with y'all. Everyone um, you meet in this uh, industry is a saint. Uh, anyway. <laughs> oh, get the anyway. Get something started. It's chicken anyway. lo mein right now. What? And it's so good that I'm going to order it. What? Chicken yeah. lo mein? I'm just going to get some chicken lo mein. We got to get you like a recipe, bro. That's an awfully sane. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let me go, let me go cook right chicken now. Chicken lo mein. You, you guys want to wait uh, 40 minutes? You guys want to wait 24 hours? <laughs> <laughs> that, that wasn't a that wasn't a poke at you apollo that was a, a poke at i want this on yes friday. yes i got it i got it what's oh, wrong what what what, what is the out. difference between thursday and friday for you he won't say. he said oh, 24 friday hours i don't stream on friday so i like it because i can just do jackbox and then fuck off Oh, so he doesn't want to stream Jackbox. He hates having something to stream. Bro. Yeah, that's crazy. No, I like streaming it. I just don't like <laughs> streaming so early because I'm tired. And you want to stay on well, once you start we, the like, Jackbox. What if we play Lethal Company tomorrow instead? I'll play Lethal Company, bro. That's what I mean. Like, it, it, to doing it today doesn't change the fact that we might still not do something tomorrow anyway. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But like, if we're doing Lethal Company, I'm streaming it. So like, I'd be streaming tomorrow. Yeah. But you're you're funny when you don't stream as well. So why don't you just hit the start streaming button? I'm glad you said as well. I, I, feel <laughs> I feel funnier when I'm not streaming. I don't know why. I think it's because I'm trying to impress like my chat. Like I gotta like like blow out my chest. Wow. Oh, does that mean off it out? What's it called? Blow, blow, <laughs> out. blow. blow, blow out. out. Gotta blow out my chest. Out my chest. <laughs> <laughs> gotta blow out my chest like alien, dude. Me pulling a well, shotgun out on stream. Chat! You're gonna get, you're gonna get banned. Gonna you're gonna get banned it. globally. You're gonna get banned. You're gonna get banned. Me when everybody in House Flipper says they're gonna paint the walls. I don't know if anybody yeah. else's brain is as broken as mine. I was like, you shouldn't oh, say that, man. Funny. Is this gonna be That's like right. Luna's first Christmas where she knows what Christmas is? Mm, uh, I don't know. As I would have to like be able to trust her. <laughs> then she lies a lot. <laughs> like <laughs> I think yeah, all man. toddlers do, but dude, she was playing a game yesterday where um she the the game was just like whatever question I ask her, she says no. So I would be like oh, I, saw. I would be like, do you like um your iPad and then she'll go no and laugh because she's lying which is fine <laughs> um, but what was hilarious is that I would say like do you like mommy and she would be like I can't say no so I'm gonna say yes and then that's really cute but then I was like do you like how many who is uh, Kate's mom and she was just no sold it she was like no I got I got no problem saying I don't like grandma. She will she will say I like daddy, I like mommy, but for the purposes of the game, she's like, yeah, fuck grandma, fuck grandpa. <laughs> and the other one, it was me oh. and Kate, she would say yes to, and then I say, Do you like ice cream? And then she'd go, Yes. <laughs> those are the those are the top three right now. She can't she can't oh, that's so funny. can't lie about ice cream. It, and Chibli too, right? Like, wow. And she's right. Lying is hilarious. It is funny. It is really funny. It is. I, I kind of made a career out of that. It's pretty good. It's I just did. like a... It's a, it's a joke. It, lying oh is just a God. joke. An pretty unethical much, yeah. joke. That's so funny. I did like when you, you asked her if Small she wanted to play the no game this morning, and she just said no. Yeah, I know. She's really good at it. <laughs> you're like, oh, she won. We'll just I mean, we got that, that one just, right. It's on the right. Yeah, yeah PBS hey! is 69. 
Man. 2011, I told you. I, I told honestly you. thought well, it was yeah, like if we just had to be play on the right had to be post side TV. of the board, fine. Yeah, <laughs> had to be true. post just, TV. Yeah, <laughs> PBS had to come out after a That's television. That's true. <laughs> it's a cool tower on the left. <laughs> it is. It looks like a dude getting ready oh, to get fucked no. in the butt, and then a dude getting ready to fuck that dude's butt. Wait, oh, wait, dude, it's oh, just wow. Ryan, you, man? <laughs> no artistic nudity. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say it's right. too artistic. Any butt fucking. It's like fucking Wally getting butt fucked. <laughs> I'm gonna assume this is in the middle because we have no. Like, France is pretty old, man. Yeah, but French Open, uh, if it's a store, maybe like two days a week. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Get their ass. Ooh. French dressing is probably old as fuck, dude. They the probably made knows, this when dude. they were like hungry. Like, French dressing is probably right. He's absolutely <laughs> right. <laughs> It's oh, oh, what? <laughs> I knew they were making toast when they were hungry. I'm sorry, did France exist in 400? About Charlemagne invented that shit. What? Charles Martel was cooking French toast. Strategic here. Did it, did they name yeah. the country after the toast? What? What? That's not how. No, no, no. This makes sense. Just don't think about it. This will make sense if you're a native English speaker. It'll just make perfect sense. I can barely speak English. Um. What? What? That's pretty early, right? <laughs> it's like the first one, right? Oh. That's the start. What? What? What does this mean? We can do this. We don't lose confidence. We can do this. What does it so, mean? I would say stack things. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't understand. In my complaint that's is about this. Adjective. My no, complaint no, no, is it's about That's not an adjective. It's about it's when intuition thing. Oh. It's when you're talking. There's an order that you describe things yes. in. It's that's what they're talking about. Yes, exactly. Oh. Like how would this Everyone's make the gone most fucking insane? This Just don't think sense. about it. No, it does. Think of think about not thinking about it. Okay. Okay. Like you say, like a small round that's, red that's not, ball. That's not real. You know I don't think that's like, real. There's an no, order that we don't realize that we do it I don't in. think it's real. I yeah, yeah, yeah. There's an order. Oh, that one's not real. That one's not real. Okay. Like, you would never say, How this is a red, adjectives? juicy apple. You'd never say more than two adjectives. This list is useless. No, you absolutely would. What are you talking middle? about? Middle? Middle? Name, middle? You name normally name wouldn't, but, like, so, you so can. So, origin, origin is last, then, probably. Because <laughs> you'd say, from here. At the this end. is made like, up of something. This not, is a, this no, it's is real. This is totally not real. real. This is not, and whoever made it is stupid. I think we're killing the, it. The, you the, do it all the time without realizing it. Yeah, you yeah, big, yeah. juicy, red, you red, big, juicy apple. It's just incredibly difficult to do. No, big, red, juicy apple. What are you talking big, about? <laughs> well, shiny, <laughs> shiny, <laughs> shiny, <laughs> juicy, big, red apple. Oh, that's a this is shit. Because I would end the sentence and be like, "Oh, he was trash, 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 trash." Oh, like it's going in the end. <laughs> it's not your fault. It's not your fault. Huh? Current, current, the, the, present, juicy red, physical. You know, this? No, no, no. You know how I know this is bullshit? Is there's a bunch of people arguing about what order you say "big red juicy apple" in, which means there is it's not you real. Fucking, if this that is many people are saying. No, no, no. You guys, why are you mad about? We're perfect. We got it perfect. There's a determined order, 100%. We actually did get it perfect. RIP! Dude, we're not, we don't, we don't speak English. What is opinion? <laughs> ah, ah. Opinion. Oh, opinion. Blah, opinion. Blah, blah, blah. Great, the great red, big, red, <laughs> juicy... Butthole. But you wouldn't say that. You'd say, like, <laughs> this juicy red apple is great. You wouldn't say great, big, juicy... What? I hate that. That's one great I big juicy that. red apple from <laughs> Mexico. Happened? When the teacher says you got to use five adjectives I'm in a angry sentence. About it. I know. The teacher never I told to me Google that. what an adjective was. This shit is fucking probably the most recent <laughs> city that's ever existed, I guess. Um it's not as any well, we're fucking you can't do it. You can't do anything. You can't do anything. This is me here. I'm gonna do this for Kip. I'm ending it. France, like the toast. No, I want to keep going. Melbourne, Melbourne, it's new. Melbourne. Melbourne. <laughs> Melbourne. Melbourne. New York City, right here. Greatest city yep. in the world, baby. <laughs> oh, well, I think we did I see it. what we could. New York City. France has got to be right. Hey, dude, two streak.
I, you're... I'm gonna clear the air on why I hate this, but I like the wheel. It's because on the wheel, I'm not letting down my teammates, but on this, I am um... letting down my teammates when I don't know something. Jim, you're my when favorite. You're not letting down your teammates. Do I don't it, think do it's it, when Corey, you don't do know something. It's when you aren't paying attention and don't move it until the last second. You're my favorite no, do it, Australian streamer from New Zealand this week. Big red what? streamer from. New I didn't want. I didn't want to. I didn't want to involve color. <laughs> what what age? Age? Quality. What do you put the age though? Complaint. What's the complaint? Uh, stinky. 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 Big red. Stinky. Juicy apple. You forgot uh, opinion though. Opinion was first. Great, tasty. I love big red, juicy, stinky apple. Me when I'm administering a dementia test. Um, sorry. <laughs> Man, apple woman, TV, camera. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've never seen it. They said those results are remarkable. We've never seen them before. We've never seen results like that before. I am changing this, packs. This shitty, Tommy. huge, old, round, red American apple. He. That's yeah. right. Yeah. <laughs> I love that we keep <laughs> we keep saying red. Red is the only color that we are okay Dude, with. Saying. Great movie. Speaking of French toast, great movie. Red is the only color. Looking at their uh, favorite hat. Thank you. Cool. Oh. <laughs> Your dog is my favorite new addition to our podcast and all group content that we do with Bala. Mm -hmm. What do you guys think? Do you think the Ravens are, are taking it all this year? I personally think nah, the, 40, dude, nah, nah, nah. the 49ers. 49ers, they're, the bro, Niners. they're frauds. They lost three games in a row this year. They lost, they're frauds. Nah, yeah, no, they had a bunch of injuries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, also, here's the one thing. one of them was completely the, uh, stolen by the reps, and the Browns shouldn't even won that game. Okay, Definitely not the true. Eagles, that's hey, for so sure. Hey, who's, so who's showing their screen? You guys are crazy. I don't know why there's this Lamar Jackson bias. Ravens are definitely clearing the fraud 49ers. No doubt about it. Well, they played this week, so we'll I know. wait till Christmas Day, dude. Now, do I think the CMC should win MVP? Absolutely. It's not an award. Oh, 100%. I mean, it's, there, there's a QB bias on the award, I understand, but I think he's CMC's right. he's been right. he's he's right. like heads and tails above it. But if Lamar Jackson and the Ravens beat the 49ers, I think he vaults into it's his award to lose, in my opinion. So do <laughs> do NFL players get paid time and a half on Christmas? Uh, they get paid time and a half every second that they they're get... in the league. <laughs> yeah. By the way, Corey, you're lucky I'm not talking about the fraudulent Eagles. They lost three games in a row in December. Oh, they, dude, they're an embarrassment. It's time to hit the panic button. I mean, in the NFC, I mean, it's wide open. Dude, I the... honestly think this is Dak Prescott's year to take the Cowboys to the Super Bowl. Even the games God, that they you played. You didn't just dude. watch the Cowboys get like absolutely lambasted by the Bills. Man, no, but the Bills are the hottest team in football right now, even if their record doesn't reflect it. Why are you so that's football really, pulled? What really the fuck that, is the going Niners on? Are the hottest <laughs> he's he's trying, like he's close, like he's saying things that are almost true. But he's, he's missing it by like. I'm just saying they the, better the stop Josh Allen actually, before he gets to the playoffs because if he gets to play a home just, game in Buffalo when it's snowing, it's the rest of the AFC he's is on notice. He's dude. not he's gonna. Is Bro falling asleep at ESPN? Like what is going on? Ryan GPT to speak. But it can only talk about. I still maintain like Eliza a million dollars. dollars. That's not how the prompt works. Oh, I'm gonna make it stream. Approaches you and offers his services by doing this. My dog will be the next level, and that person's won. It's your turn to roll. Do you let him do it? <laughs> Is he rubbing his boner, or are you rubbing his boner? It I sounds don't like care. I'm gonna get a million dollars. Yeah, yeah self-described lucky charm. He's taking all of the like possible repercussions on his shoulders. What are you like, talking you're about? Get in trouble if he gets caught rubbing his boner under there. I don't even care if he. I got. I don't need any proven winning. If a guy walks up to me rubbing his boner, he's like, "Let me roll those dice." I'm giving him the dice because he's fucking crazy. <laughs> 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 the dice and walk you away, guys man. are. You guys are victims, bro. If this oh, dude says, not, "Hey, not rub my boner. It's good money. luck." Uh -huh. I'm getting the fuck out of the casino. You are what the, the only one. You're crazy. Oh, yeah, I didn't split oh, yeah, the room. The one to five. You're the you, one. You're That's insane. How that works. You guys have yeah. lost your mind. I don't want to rub a boner in a <laughs> casino. <laughs> you said a yes. No, oh, I no, said, that was your problem. You that was my problem. <laughs> but by do to raise awareness for hepatitis B. <laughs> sure. You support this cause. Do you Makes sense. 
No. I'm not even face revealed. If I'm I already have to well known for supporting the cause, I don't think I have to slap my ass. That's true, isn't it? Yeah, you don't necessarily need to voice your opinion in this. But moment. that's more of a problem with the prompt than it is the. Well, then you're gonna get like response. a DM that's like, "Hey, I know you support this cause. Why are you not participating in slapping uh, and, your and ass?" And then I'm gonna <laughs> ignore that DM. I'm very Why disappointed seen in a you. video of you slapping your ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking. You are right. That would happen. Imagine a lot 1930. Slap his ass. <laughs> I just want to tweet that now and tag Joe Biden. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no one participated. Bro, I'm doing ass. this shit. Even yeah, Martin Shkreli slapped his ass, bro. Slap ass. I'll do this right now. You gotta pay me good money to slap my ass. I'll do it. I'm, I'm doing it. Oh, wow, this is a base in one of those. That was my thigh. By spritzing yourself with a magical spray, but you'd rub a dude's boner under the table for nothing, <laughs> right? <laughs> you wouldn't slap your own ass. Didn't you say no, Ryan? Yeah, because I wouldn't, and I wouldn't slap my own ass for social media clout either. Right outside, Ooh. you run into an old woman who tells you she had to pawn that ring to buy this. Oh, <laughs> Christmas oh. gift for a cousin. A cousin. This sounds like this scam. It sounds like it's smart because if, if, if they had said like a, like a wi like wife or, or someone, right? Like you'd be like, oh, okay. But if it's a cousin, you're like, kind of like thinking about it. Like, no, I give, I'm not giving it back to her no matter what. She can have it back if she gives me $200. I'm not involved in this situation. Why does it cost me $200? That's not how this works, relationship. Right? What are you talking about? <laughs> she pawned it and she got the money, and now she's like, "Give me the thing that I gave up for the money." Yeah, I ain't no, giving her back. She wants it back without the money. That's I know. The that's why I'm not gonna give it to her. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I am that's putting myself word. in like the most literal. Oh, you're all like fucking so greedy. About <laughs> what are you, you're getting scammed. <laughs> you ain't getting that ring back, dude. I was trying to think, I yeah, because I was like, I have to go with something more distant for... than like a son or a fucking spouse. Isn't this literally a scam? People do it like know, gas stations like and shit? Said no either way. Yeah, yeah. You're not yeah. reading and assuming they're fucking lying in the prompt. It yeah, doesn't yeah. matter if they're lying. It's actually, I would rather get scammed than just give them the ring. At least they tricked me if they scammed me. Oh, I got to think about this one, dude. I'm All right, this is an easy one. You can't, I'm assuming you can't just cover your eyes with a well, you're sleeping my, oh, for two thousand dollars uh, right now i'll do this on stream <laughs> <laughs> oh shit i forgot it was for two thousand dollars he's so yeah, smart I, I say i don't know if my gaming rgbs are on dude i can't even sleep like i would be fucked for a whole week light doesn't wow. even bother me that was a good split that was super a split, split. That was super split super split I'm keeping that ring though. 2K for a week, bro? You'd have to be stupid not to keep the ring. I think I would talk it through with the person that sold the ring. I'd be like, hey, uh, we, we can uh, give me a hundred dollars. I just bought it for 200. You can have it back for 300. Yep. I'm just going on my eBay store, bro. Check me out. <laughs> give her a QR code business uh, card. My verses come straight from the cock. <laughs> <laughs> My rhymes hit hard like a Glock. It's fire. I'm slam dunking rhymes like a bat. I'm mixing my sports up like that. Oh! Mars! <laughs> Mars! Nice! Okay. Great recovery. Okay. That was clever. Very good. I was raised in the tough part of Lowe's. <laughs> Came up with the rakes and the hose. Oh, shit. Oh. I always buy organic because I'm rich as one percenter. Pacific to Atlantic, I do biz business under pressure. Shit. What the hell? Okay, those are two both very good. Lowe's and hose is really good. That is tough. I'm glad that the two of you went against each other, so you can kind of... <laughs> yeah, what the hell? They're having a goat off. Cancel each other out. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's dead even. That's pretty nice. close. Damn. Well done, well done. The split, dude. Well done. Congratulations, yo. All right, now let's hear some good rap. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. Oh, no, dude. I got to slow down. I'm getting too bald. Sorry, I got to take this. Your mom just called. Oh. Call me That's Cantankerous. Out, I be Tinky Winky. I'm gonna push your old ass down the stairs like a slinky. Hey. 
Oh, what the fuck? Man. What the fuck? <laughs> Very good. Uh, what the fuck? Gears and gear. Some say I'm flashy. Some say I'm intelligent. Got more rhymes and pages than a tree ant. <laughs> My mom always says I'm her number one. <laughs> um, she really doesn't. You're the sucker. <laughs> favorite of the night dude these these beats are fire open your eyes and see what's running don't look away because i'm too cunning i'm dressed to kill you're dressed to droop devil wears prada you wear poop <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> it's kind of sick it's kind of sick it's really good i was grooving dude this is i love this don't think for a minute that you're even smart I'm 6,000 Earths ahead, you're huffing fart. <laughs> Keep your head, don't lose your very grippy. I don't oh, know no. what that means, I'm leaving in a jiffy. Thanks! <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> That's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> don't lose uh, for people who don't get the joke, uh, in the wheel, they told, they asked us, how many... <laughs> Hey, I had to think of something. They said, how many Earths away from the moon is, from the Earth is the moon? And Apollo said 6,000. And then he also said, anyone who didn't say a huge number for this is an idiot. And then it was like five. <laughs> oh, Whatever. Man. I won the battle. It's I don't need to hear it. I just wanted to make sure everyone's up on the references. Okay. That is true. Corey, be like my rhymes hit hard like a hydrogen bomb. Sorry, I've got to go fuck my mom. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> it was the opposite way. I didn't write the first sentence. <laughs> <laughs> you better be bringing it, dog. I'm bringing the heat. I can't believe it said I'm my number, my mom's number one fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to really ask good. you, did you, did you just say fucker or what did you say? Yeah, I just said like fucker. Oh, okay. Just checking, just checking, just checking. I'm going to go grab my food. Oh, I need to add God. another minute on this. And it would be the best game That's what I was saying. Oh, oh my God. God. Matt Reeves oh. making the Batman. Sorry. Um. It's funny you, it's think, funny you think I'm a house. <laughs> I'm providing for your family while you're playing pet mouse. You're more boring than family guy. Hey PETA, the lame guy is here. <laughs> it's so, so experimental. That was, was a four second gambit. This ain't for people who got no synonym for ability. Break out the thesaurus and just say chibbly. Why don't you leave? Go back to the Ohio. Does New Zealand even have one? Whatever. Bye, ho. Wow. Wow. Uh, wow. Got him. Pet Mouse is a reference to Super Auto Pits. Uh, I just made that up right now. Give you a bonus <laughs> point five. <laughs> You see, it told me to type synonym for ability, and then I realized that would rhyme with Chibli, so I just typed synonym for ability. We're not having a mid-off! <laughs> no, yeah, one of us did really good. Hey, <laughs> Annie got the chair bonus. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> it really do be your own. Me, when I'm in the rap war and I have to beat Chibli? Guy holding the gun with the tear coming down his face. Sorry. You're not so hot. You're a regular sheep. One that's been sheared. I hope this doesn't cut deep. Oh. I've heard better sounds coming out of a sheep. <laughs> be the deep beep de okay. deep de deep deep. <laughs> <laughs> I started scatting at the end. <laughs> I like it. 
<laughs> I'm going to put it against Ryan. I think you're wearing your mama's assless chaps. I'm in the know because I hear the clap, clap, clap. <laughs> if you were dying of thirst, I wouldn't give you a Mountain Dew. I'm just kidding, bro. Have some of this piss, dude. <laughs> Corey's on position today. over there, dude. Corey's killing him, man. You're gonna piss in his mouth while he's getting fucked in the ass? <laughs> She's fucking dirty, bro. It is disgusting. <laughs> Most disgusting rap of all time. <laughs> I didn't even look at it that way, man. <laughs> you wrote it. You wrote it. Wow, I already needed my scat. <laughs> oh, man. Corey probably would have liked it with the theme he was going So with. true. Who's going to be still standing? It's fucking gross, man. <laughs> Your rhymes are tasteless, like overcooked donuts. Mine are amazing. Make the room go nuts. I'm falling asleep. Your verses are antiquated. All of your words just sound like math equations. Ooh! It must hurt to be that crap. <laughs> let me call my friend Will to let me call my friend Will to give you a slap. Your rhymes are bad because you're dumb as a dummy. Now that's a rap because you're a mummy. Oh, dude, this strong. <laughs> I love it. Okay, yo, Apollo yeah, kind of fell apart, man. What? It's amazing! I feel like it came together. He, he put him in the sarcophagus. Yeah. True? Oh, shit. I feel like the game kind of owned you a little bit on the first one. Yeah. It's so short. <laughs> the second one wasn't that great either with the dumb dummy. <laughs> <laughs> no! Ooh, that might split, that might split, the, might split the lead here. Oh, we got chair bonus though. Oh, you got no. It's fine. It's fine. You're good. I don't know. Corey had a lot. Corey did have a big round, yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh! It's so nice. fitting that you're a, to a toilet. <laughs> it's not a toilet. It's a toilet, bro. It does look like a toilet. Oh, maybe it's a portable it didn't look like a toilet CD before, player. Though. Yeah, it opened up oh, earlier. No, it's a portable CD player. A week of Eminem impressions does not pay off, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> this is very true. I think it's because you were imitating post-recovery Eminem instead of in his prime. No. Yeah. I think yeah. it's, uh, it's wheel, wheel time. time. It must be wheel yeah. time, of course. What words are spoken by oh, the who the fuck is Wireless? Who the fuck is Wireless? Who is that? Yeah. Oh! He said Willis. Oh. My favorite character. I think he had a fun little Come nickname, on. but... I can't remember what it is. This is annoying. This is a yeah, waste of time. what's the point of this? <clears throat> this one is a waste of time. When did this game come Watch out? Watch, we're know all about the, the wrong. Spoiler? Did well, they know about it's his spoiler? first four seasons. Right, but when did the... Because was, was season six... That's, that's a season five, Andy, when they introduce um, the that's fucking... season six, Andy? Lumbar Greyjoy or whatever the kid's name is. Lumbar. Is that what you said? What? They, 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't pick Hodor. Oh, no. You should have picked Hodor. That's what he says in the first four seasons. He says Hodor. They really like overestimated the staying power of Game of Thrones. So oh, yeah. it was true. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I didn't pick Hodor. I still played Fortnite yesterday. I played Fortnite yesterday. It's the best game ever made. Mm. I got killed by Batman last night. <laughs> yeah, I got killed by Goku the other day. Least points. Spun himself. Least points. Hey, audience, this is your you should give Please points don't. to I the person with the least points. The fewest slices. Most. The fewest. The guys, fewest. This is rebellion. Rebellion. Jack, come on. Fewest. He thinks you're fewest stupid. Slices. Oh wait, Justin has agency. Justin has the fewest. Justin has the fewest. It would surprise yeah, me if just it Don't would surprise win. me if Justin has the fewest. Someone else has one, right? Oh, I know it's true. I've got two. Ryan has one. <clears throat> My ass got one, bitch. Read him and weep. I want to know what you picked. High card six. How did you only get one slice? I stacked them all up because I had to happen? go for the I had to swing for the fences. Okay. Oh. If this lets him win. 
No, Just there's remember. no way, right? <laughs> nah, he ain't winning. He ain't winning. Spin me. I've got so many slices, dude. You gotta hit me no, with a solo. Fuck you. Yo! Oh! Way to go, Corey. Way to go. Ooh. I hate when I, he predicts it. I mean, I didn't win, but now I've got a good chance. Not yet. Way to go. Not yet. All right, here's how you do it, Corey. You gotta spin yourself. Yeah, just don't get my other solo slice. That'd be really embarrassing. Wow! Hey, oh, hey. <laughs> Dude's got There's two in the pink. Slices. I'm back. <laughs> pretty, pretty close game. Everyone's above 10k. Yeah. Okay, this is scary though. This is a scary spin for everyone. Nah, owns, and if I don't hit something, I'm gonna fucking revolt. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, the biggest one. Four thousand. Oh, he gets the spin for win. Oh, my question was so important. Here comes baby. He's good at this part too. No he one never ever gets wins the first, the first one. Spin. No one ever gets the first one. <laughs> I got it in his head, bro. I got it in his head. He didn't get the first one. We get another I spin. Felt it too. I it was gonna happen. This is a big spin. This is a big spin. I got last so spin. Spaces. I got so many Hit me spaces. again, motherfucker. Hit me. I got so many spaces. Yeah. Oh yeah. Don't spin mine because then it'll spin Apollo. Justin and also Justin has a lot so of spaces. Many spaces. It's wow! God, How ridiculous. in the world? God damn it! Damn, that's a high score. That's yeah. a lot of points. Fucking God's favorite child bullshit is what that is. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, I'm God's special gamer. Uh, Justin seems like a loser on the 50 50 to me. What the fuck? Dude made the nice <laughs> list for real. Oh, 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 my mind. Oh, hey, <laughs> we go again. We go again. We yeah, go I'm again. Gone. I'm gonna die in real life. <laughs> this is cooking up to be a good game. Oh, let's do a quick recap. Uh, well, I'm probably gonna hit 20k just on the points, so I just need to get my well, uh, slices, man. I, 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 I'm just seeing Ryan. Somehow pulling out the victory here. Just good categories. Gonna, somehow. I need to try, so please give me categories for people that aren't like 35. Fucking Velvet Underground 1990s me, movies by on, Rotten Tomato on. score. Yes! This or that of the century. <laughs> I feel like a genius. I couldn't get, I couldn't get out of Suncoast video. Oh, so I need to Ooh. retract. I think I was born in the era oh, of malls. I, I just I traveled, so actually. Much. Oh, this was a lot wilder than I thought. Um, this is a hard one, dude. Yeah, this is way harder than I expected. I think, I, I think there's I mean, a, I think there's a red herring in here too. Uh huh. Please. Tell I think me they'll let you. They, they won't let you take a red herring on your on one. No, no, no. It's fish. I think. What's fish? A red herring. Time. Oh. Oh. Hey. Okay. Oh, oh, that was way oh, less I than terrible. I thought. I did so yeah, I did too crazy. Many. <laughs> that was way less than I thought. I think we all too many, huh? You can't I'm take a foam toy sword? Yeah, I didn't I've think they were. I, I didn't think Antlers? they would let. I didn't think they would let sand on. <laughs> Why I've wouldn't they let the foam sand? Sword, I don't know man. biological <laughs> components like if you're like traveling. Sand on the Why can't they help hook you? If, what if you're going to Australia? I guess bring you along. Well, I know, but like you can just take him in the carry-on on its own bag or something. Why are they not allowed? I I need to get someone fired. I've seen someone with a foam sword. They had a Minecraft sword and they were sitting next to me. Shit. I'm in, bitch. I, think, I can't fucking oh, remember. Am I going to look like an idiot? Oh, I think I went too and high. That's no on idea. British science. I have no oh, idea. I went too I high. I'm an idiot. I foregore. Uh -huh, I'm a fool here. This is your know. system, bro. Bro, no one cares. Don't, don't, don't bro, my bro. So I was off by two. I was off by a hundred. I always overshoot. Question America, bat chess. <laughs> 320 degrees. Jesus Christ. Honestly, I should have just pulled up the calculator. I know the formula to convert, but I don't know how much fucking... I could have just typed a hundred times nine fifths plus 32. He's right. If it gave Celsius and someone got that wrong, there is an issue going on. I could have done that math in my damn head, man. 900 plus 30. Dude, rap on. god. He is spitting. I'm pissed because I feel like there was. I, I just guessed like an idiot. I could have figured it out. Like, not an idiot. I, I, I typed in numbers before I thought as well. You could also just know it that like it's 212. No math required. I don't know why I thought fucking 10. That's pretty I don't know why I thought 131. You, you were rounding. You were rounding. My yeah, house yeah. did the miles per hour conversion from kilometers an hour, dude. Solo square, solo square, solo square. Wow! Yes! yes. Vote for him no. to be put in the guillotine in the game. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> hit in tuba, hit in tuba. 
The worst part he, is he, someone he's else's not gonna, question. He's not going to win on this. He's not going to win on this. No, that's My such bad. good odds. It's over. He's missing this. He's missing this. They look like nuts. They look like... Yay! Damn. Wait, it's, it's cruel today, dude. What? <laughs> they, should have, they should have asked a question to the audience. Oh, oh wait. Do hey, I this is have safe. This points? is safe. I don't think it is. That's crazy, no, that's bro. That's, that's crazy. That's pretty wild. It's your Ryan has the power slices. No. Me get spun oh. ever challenge. Difficulty degree possible. Oh, my God. Oh, no. <laughs> Anything but this. Come on, man. It's kind of, it's kind of comical, y'all. It's, it's kind of comical. Fucking ridiculous. <laughs> oh my God. He loses. He loses. No, no. Right? I'm gonna spin to lose. Right? I'm gonna spin to lose. I'm having so much fun. No, I'm gonna spin don't lose, fucking. Right? It's over. It's over. Oh, yeah. That's so ridiculous, man. man. I hate that I predicted it. Unbelievable. <laughs> and then spun for him. Crazy comeback, so, though. There was. I was in last for a brief period. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's My ass had to think about hamster for longer really? than I feel like I, the most of these, the dude. Longer than I should have. Nah, this is another American question. Hamsters are banned in New Zealand, and we have zero of them. This is bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> can't be this few. Oh, I think I fucked this up. I was I so confident not, too. I hope it's not shampoo. Where I'm confu like confused about what I've been putting on my head. Oh, oh, I fucked it up. They fucking baited me with oh, that's cool. Oh. Look at us. Uh, what would so brouhaha be a mix of? Uh, brown and a haha. -ha. -ha. <laughs> I didn't think mockumentary was one. I thought that was what just the like fuck a does... prequel. What are the it's two? It's a mock documentary. Yeah. Preceding sequel. Oh, oh god damn you, it. Is <laughs> Preceding <laughs> is? Previous is, but like that's not what pre. Oh, but I, don't I, don't I don't know this shit. I don't know this shit. You know this oh, shit. I know this oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, I know yeah. this shit. I don't know this shit at all. Well, the Kramer one's easy. What? No, it isn't. Dude, yes, I know none of this. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's yeah. right. He's right. He's right. <laughs> I only got two of them. I'm going to start clicking shit, I guess. Yeah, well, I might as well. I somehow movie? haven't gotten any wrong, but I'm just That's clicking randomly. Oh, OK, I got one wrong. What was she Margaret Thatcher in? These are all. It's just giving me two lists of like <laughs> words I don't know. I mean, I know the words, but that's it. Oh, fuck oh, I got me. Two. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I almost oh, got, I got two. Three. I got two. I got four Wait, right in a row and then nothing else. I've I'm seen so one of two. these movies. Can you guess which um, one? <laughs> I think, I, weirdly enough, I think it's the Adaptation. Post. It's the post. It's Into the Woods. Oh, the that was so obvious. <laughs> <laughs> you should see Adaptation. Though. That's a movie. It's good. Follow. Yeah, it's a good movie. Brian had five hours of warm-up into Nerdle. This is unfair. That's true. Yeah, right? <laughs> I always ban Meryl Streep, though, because I don't know where movies. Don't go on the two uh, X's. Going on all of them. Name a woman. Name a woman. Wow. Oh, okay, cool. How did Lots I get of solo so fucking... slices, dude? Oh my god. Two solo, two X. Ryan got great. three solo slices. I don't care about I mean, solos, man. It doesn't slices. make them any more likely to be spun. Yeah, but it gives yeah, but you, you all the points when you points. land on them. Oh, yeah. God <laughs> damn it. He doesn't even crazy. need a solo, dude. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't deserve these most solo points. slices. Most points. Why would we give them most points? Oh, oh mix them all up. Yeah, dude. mix them up. Go for no, sale. Sure. Make them worth more. Mix them up. Mix them. Mix them the fuck up. Mix them all up. Mix them up. Mix it up. It doesn't matter. That shit's more fucked than the health of Kim Mathers. Let's see what you said. Okay. And so it shall be. Mm -hmm. That's a good dog. What happened? Day. Damn it, baby. How did I lose those. the slice? <laughs> oh, no, all my slices are gone. gone. What? Yeah. I only had slices. <laughs> How did you I lose my one slice? Oh, it hooked me up. Game, dude. Oh, my God. It deleted three of my slices. <laughs> oh, Wait, it gave me it gave me two. Dude, it gave me two also. I Why do I have this game, dude? It's so masochistic. Like, we know what's gonna happen. The points you steal are fixed. Thank God. <laughs> I gotta steal from Corey. I'm sorry. Because all the ones with three people are ones that I'm on. Well, I think no, we just I'm on steal that the one other too. Two. Ow, ow, ow. 
Jesus oh, Christ. Christ. I don't think you steal from yourself. While you're up here, you might as well. Oh, I live. Oh, I'm still in. Go ahead. Go you ahead. Mix them up. Mix them up. I hate. Them up. I, hate I don't like the oh, wheel yeah. anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the point differential right now. Most slices. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, David would be really Yay. funny if you gave him to the most. Be nice Yay. to Justin. It's been fewest every time. It has to continue to No, that's really why we have to change it. it. That's what I said last time and you went, no. Yeah, because it would have benefited you instead of me. It won't benefit you. Justin has more than you. No shot. <laughs> Whoa, that was dangerous. I would have, I would have been mad. Yay. Let's go, Corey. Let's go. Points, points, points. He does. How did we get holy? Fucked by that so bad. I had one more than you. Oh, God damn. Oh, this is so oh, easy. No, this is hard as fuck, bro. This is so easy. What are you talking about? Is it? Yes. When they got the fucking. I'm not even going to say it. That was so easy. You're, I have no you're idea. You're crazy. Yeah, you, bro. you know way more about these than I do. That's crazy that no one, people don't yeah, know. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely an easy one, right? Hey, guys, like this is so like easy. It's so easy or, until they know, pull carrot on your ass. <laughs> I don't bro. know about that, I guess. I don't think I, I got do, it. Does a carrot have a seed, bro? I clicked things. It with must seeds. at some point. <gasps> yes, yes, I clicked things with seeds. Oh, like, no. Man, just click the things with the seeds. I did. I did. That's what I did. I did. Yeah, that. Yeah. I did that. I didn't know what I, I didn't know that at all. Hey, what so did easy. I miss? <laughs> Technically, it's a what tie, did I... but uh, only one of you. I feel like I aced it. What the I fuck did I do? Fuck you! Are you stupid? Does it do it on purpose? It just oh, this. Oh, 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 I think it's host advantage. Honestly, yeah. I feel like there's some coding in the back. What end. are you talking about? I think he put I, some coding in the back. I end. got in like 10 seconds before anyone else. Yeah, your ass was <laughs> six seconds slow on Emily Dickinson. No, and no one's yeah, talking shit I, about that. that. Wasn't for, that wasn't for power slice. You got two fucking slices. This sucks. I got three. I gotta get like three, three? solos oh, in a row great. to have a chance here, man. Can they patch this game? I didn't out the You oh never win yeah, on the first <laughs> base. He did say that. With three people. <laughs> he did say that. Two of my slices Bro, you have, have Ryan on it, man. This is crazy. You guys hate each other. I literally We should no celebrate chance. each other's wins, Yay! okay? Shut <laughs> <up>. <laughs> <laughs> Can we, like, take slices away from him? Reset. No, oh, full, full, full as we go again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 full, full, full. More, more trivia, more trivia. More trivia. We have a chance that way. It's easy. Just go full and then don't spin me. We're going to spin him. He's, now that he said that, someone's going to fucking yeah, spin him, man. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, my God. Well, who's who's spinning next? It's Chibli. I think Ryan. Ryan is hitting the tuba. Ooh, I can't wait to see what you all said. He's so excited. On to the aftermath. Is there even another spin? That's yeah, something that you can say. Spin. You can say that uh, in like any okay. situation. Onto the aftermath. That's that's a cool thing to oh, say. Ghibli. Basically, no matter okay, what. I have a strategy. Mm. There's one single space where I can get points and Ryan doesn't win. This is bullshit. I only clicked twice. <laughs> <laughs> I clicked twice. <laughs> oh, unbelievable! Oh, bother, guys. Don't <laughs> worry. I'll just not spin <laughs> the. I'll try not to spin myself. I wouldn't want to ruin the game. Uh, There's no I way he does it care. again. No, right? it's gonna give it. This, this no, so he doesn't obvious. want it. So. <laughs> yes. oh, hey, you're welcome. Oh my god. Oh, phew. Thanks, Ryan. Ryan, thank you. You're really carrying this wheel for us, man. You made sure no, to save no, us for no, this. No, no, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. When we put together our professional wheel team, I'm choosing you for sure. Yeah. I like the way they say power ow, slice. Ow, ow, ow. I've been jumped on. Me when I'm a Goomba. Mm. <laughs> 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 yeah, got him, got him back, got him back. It's pretty good. I only have four slices? Baron Ryan had like six. Listen, here. I have five, okay? Four is still pretty five? good. Okay, I thought you had more. Son of a bitch. Look How at I this. So oh, fucking potpourri. Uh, Every one of my slices this. has a winner on it again. Oh, hey. That's a crazy spin, Dude, I did though. a tiny spin and it was great. 
Oh, 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 that, I'll take it, I'll take it! Pretty freaking good. I can win now! Uh, full Wait, wheel, full we wheel. going again? Like, what? Oh what my if? god, you and Justin oh, are just like right, yeah. <laughs> right up against it. Full, 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 full. <laughs> Trivia, <laughs> trivia, <laughs> trivia. They love the wheel, they love it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm edging to this, like, in this game. <laughs> we might see a reset, dude. No shot. Oh, I have no enough shots. I mean, all we have to do is spin the Chibli slice right there, and then it's fine. Okay. Unless, wait, that it might give him, like, 6,000 points, though. He could win off of that. But he needs 8,000. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 baby. It might be enough. I kind of want to spin the, the five piece, though. It is. Nuts on the table, bitch. Here we go. You don't have a choice, man. It's what God decides. It's everybody but me! Oh, <laughs> oh my God. It's gonna be we all get to spin, dude. Oh, oh, spin. Yeah, all of us Pretty get much. to spin. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow! I I yelled, oh, I'm edging to this when my, this my sucks. mother was right outside my window. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know what let's it means. Go, let's go, let's go, let's go. And it's not me. Wow! No! Oh my God! Oh my I'm God. terrible! We go again. We got more trivia, we go again. man. We go more again. That's okay. My wife's not back from Costco yet. Why didn't I put a score? Let's go. Also, my mom, my mom might know what edging is because one day she asked me if I knew what pegging was. What Why would she ask you that? What'd you say? I don't know, man. This is the most awkward <laughs> part of my life, bro. How do you answer that question? Yeah, I'm curious how he did. I said yes. What the fuck? All right, at least you're honest. Yeah, I'm pegging right, right, right now, mom. That she means I'm really excited on the internet. Question should be enough. One question? Apparently One question, wow. What rhymes with tile? What oh, I love oh, these. Oh, boy. My wordle, my wordle knowledge, man. <laughs> Rifle. <laughs> oh, uh... Um... Excuse me? Wait, what? Yeah, some of these yeah, are rhymes for sure, dude. That Why definitely rhymes, right? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, shit, I forgot it's about file. <laughs> I'm not winning this one, so I'm going to keep guessing. Oh, oh that's a good thing. Give me the last one. Bear and Apollo. Oh, give me the last one. Oh. Isle. 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 Apostrophe, Isle. Isle. Let's go. They didn't have V-I-A-L on there? Doesn't I know. They didn't, I, I typed it in and it said wrong. I'm thinking Why did we give you guys a bonus one? We, we said had, words no one else said. Oh, okay. Holy fuck. fuck. Holy fuck. Fuck. Why is there only one question? Apollo gets rigged. the power slice. Oh my god, this is... We've never been here before. This is crazy. How are you doing, Bear? <laughs> Pretty <laughs> awful. <laughs> if you got nuts, you, stack them up on one space. This has been rough, man. I don't know. Wait, what if I don't have nuts? Everyone over 20k should go on the bottom two times. Honestly, mm. leave the two X's for the people who still need points, man. Don't. Yep. Thanks. Yep. Yep. Okay. Wow. Fuck that Ryan's rule, I guess. Ryan. Ryan. <laughs> Ryan. Yeah. Yeah. What? Selfish over there. Selfish. I get to spin again? Purple, purple, purple. I'm in the so much purple on the chibli, 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 chibli. Oh! <laughs> oh. Oh, There's no way I lose this fucking same wheel spin again, right? There's no oh way. my god. <laughs> There's no way I lose this again, right, guys? I'm, I'm in your corner on this one. I want There's you to no win. way I lose it again. You're I mean, winning on this one. Oh! Good game, good game, good game. Congratulations. Good game. 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 Wait a minute, wait a minute. No! Ah! Yeah. <laughs> it always gives like an ambiguous answer, except that time. It was, it was. It's pretty over certain, my dead wheel oh. body. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Put some emphasis on that one. Oh my god. All right. Good gaming, Violet. Nice. Good gaming. Fun. Good Great game. Great gaming. 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 Good a good game. jack session. Yeah, dude. So true. 
GG. Will they put Ariana Grande in Fortnite Festival? That was my question. I'll never know. Mm, what, what Ariana song do you want to play? Any of them. Dude, Seven Rings, why um, not? How about Break Up With Your Girlfriend? Open parentheses, because I'm bored. Sure, then I'll take that. How about uh, Seven Rings? Yeah, 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 yeah. They should do uh, maybe one of the Christmas ones. Santa Tell Me? holiday season. Yeah, Santa yeah, yeah. Santa Tell or, uh, Me? December, uh, or December. How about a little uh, Thank You Next? Oh, I forgot about oh, that Oh, that one. would be a really good one. That'd be a really good one, too. I think that'd be the best, actually. How about um, Bang Bang Into the Room? That's bang, bang Bang Into, into the, the Room. You sang my soul so high to the moon window. Dude, you almost got me, dude. What? Bang, that is, it's Ariana Grande. Bang, 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 That's Ariana Grande? Bang. There's Ariana Grande, Nicki Minaj, and Jesse J. Oh, okay. I thought it was like fucking Toto, bro. People are saying, no, it's not. Ready? Bang, bang. Song by Ariana Grande, Jesse J, and Nicki Minaj. Oh! <laughs> I'm still playing the wheel. I'm about to run a solo round. <laughs> she got a body yeah. like an hourglass, but I can give it to you all the time. She got a booty like a Cadillac, but I can send you into overdrive. Oh. Ooh. That's fun. <laughs> yeah. 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 Absolutely. All right. all right, later, Lance, later. Bye. 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 So, like, I'm supposed to send you over to my wife. She left for Costco like three and a half hours ago. That's not an outrageous length of time for a Costco trip in December, I think. It's longer than I would have expected. If I may be, um, if I may mention something about my wife without it coming across as malevolent, I do think sometimes she underestimates the length of time a task will take. So like if you were to ask her a task that takes half an hour and you said, how long would it take you? I think she would say 10 minutes. So me personally, I think that it's possible she was like, I'm gonna get some stuff done before the Costco trip. And I only need like an hour to get there, to get back and to do all the shopping. And then maybe there was like a little, or maybe not, maybe she, maybe she got into a snafu in the parking lot. Maybe she dropped the 30 rack of Coke Zero on her toe and I'm the asshole. All right, we are back with Cine 2 Nerdle today. Cine 2 Nerdle battles um, because we're, we're marking some time until my wife makes it back. We're 10 0 and 1 today. Planet of the Apes, 1968. I don't want, I need Stanley Kubrick to be on band so I can escape from this. But I can ban him because then they can't use him after guess one. Stanley Kubrick, let's ban Jack Nicholson, and let's ban somebody who's old as hell, Kirk Douglas, and then try to force them into the modern era. She's black! Bat! Planet of the Apes, 1968. Beneath the... Yeah? She needs my help. Okay, slash marker, end of Cine 2 Nerdle. I'll be back in one moment. I'm back. Whew. I took in all the Costco groceries and it only took eight trips. That's a new record. Oh. Oh, she got the 30 rack. And not only did she get the Coke Zero 30 rack. I see you, Kate. I see you with the drink, Riz. She got a... a Two for a bubbly as well. That's 54 cans of beverages. She got the fizz riz. Fizz so good she rizzed herself. I don't even want to know what I lost on, by the way. <laughs> so you are you're the luckiest person in the world. I could have torched you on this. This is what I like to play. I would have taken you to the cleaners, kid. <laughs> well, I don't know. Your record's actually really good. What was their name? Letterbox Larry? James Franco? Andy Circus? 
and Woody Harrelson. They're a guest? No, no, no. This person is not a guest. They're letterbox God. Rise of Planet of the Apes, 2011. I say Daddy's Home too, John Lithgow. That's a, that's a Christmas movie, by the way. Plus one point. Invincible, 2006. That's a Philadelphia movie. Bradley Cooper, The Silver Linings Playbook. I'm stupid. I'm just going to say Shooter. <laughs> I thought your cardio was cracked. Why are you so out of breath? My cardio is cracked. Imagine how gassed you would sound. The Martian. Nah, it's not going to go down like that. We will go with, a, we'll start with a Mystic Pizza. Plus one. Thank you. We also, I want the plus one for, for Daddy's Home as well, please. Matt Damon kill shot. I always, what was our Matt Damon kill shot that I forgot about? Something that doesn't have Ben Affleck in it. The informant. <laughs> the informant. No, no, I wasn't good. Oh, the Great Wall was going to be, you're right. It's the Great Wall. Cast. Soderbergh. Damon. Other individuals. Delete your account. <laughs> rematch requested. Hang on. Don't, don't deny the rematch just yet. I just have to see if my wife's... Oh, they left the battle. I want to see if you're... Just let me know when you're ready to stream. And I will send them. Smiley face. What's better, Soderbergh or sourdough? Begrudgingly, I say sourdough. It's crazy to me that there are people out there who don't like sourdough. They know it's just bread, right? Like it's not going to hurt you? Unless you have a gluten intolerance, I suppose. Or it's like a little more sour than bread, but when you compare it to like a lemon... Or a warhead? <laughs> Benita, you're not getting the Benita Planet of the Apes, 1970? What are you doing, Airsats Coffee? Kangaroo Jack Skip? Bro, are we really doing this? You're skipping me on that? Okay, take me to Scary Movie 3. Hey, normal dude, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. You're out of worthwhile lifelines already. Fern Gully, The Last Rainforest? What are we doing? Are we just memeing? Are you playing the game just to meme? You know if you wanted to type a joke, you don't have to stick to the confines of Cine 2 Nerdle. I'm going to take Bamboozled. That's the wrong Wayans brother. I'm going to take Girls Trip. Whenever he says Kangaroo Jack, I think of Simple Jack, and I'm like, that's not real, right? Are you talking about, uh, oh, Nisha Bend on Jack? You are Nisha Bend on Jack. Goodbye. I don't know anybody. Listen, Airsats Coffee, I don't mean to be rude. What do you know? <laughs> so you don't know shit about Scary Movie. You don't know shit about Kangaroo Jack. And you don't know shit about Girls Trip. I only played like four movies. And you, you lifelined on three of them. These are big pictures, man. All right, Kate says she is ready. You're bullying? I'm not bullying. I'm just saying, what, why don't you play a movie you know? Not everyone is good at everything. That's true. Hang on, my wife's describing the Costco trip. She said it was, going to Costco was like the world ended. 
And I believe that because this Costco is bad at the best of times. <laughs> but we made it alive. Let's go. I am so... Normally, I don't give you a window into my private conversations with my wife. I'm so impressed you got everything by yourself, plus took care of our daughter and the Coke and the bubbly. And then an emoji. Emoji is triumph. Triumph emoji will go hard here. Yeah, sure. We got time for a rematch. <laughs> I was talking a lot of shit. I didn't think we were going to go again. Rise of Planet of the Apes. Okay. Daddy's home too. It's kind of crazy Mark Wahlberg didn't come back for Daddy's Home 2. He was like half of the draw of Daddy's Home 1. Pain and Gain. Okay. Southland Tales via Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Fast X via Dwayne Johnson. Skyscraper. Dwayne Johnson kill shot. You just saw it's the connection? Excuse me. No, I didn't. The connection is John Lithgow, my friend. Skyscraper skip. Scream six. Scream five. Scream. Oh, because Marky Mark's not in Rise of Planet of the Apes. That's right. Oh, I see what you're saying. I get the picture. How about Scream 2? You might know Drew Barrymore is in Scream 1. Oh, don't give me, don't give me this Jamie Kennedy kill shot. I'm going to cry. They're thinking. That's fair. It's very fair. There's got to be, the, his wife in Son of the Mask must be famous. I think a lifeline can save us. I don't think it's going to be necessary. <laughs> That'll, good game, good game. All right. I will send you to my wife's stream. I'll be live tomorrow, barring, like, catastrophe, of course. It is my plan to be live tomorrow. Uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of your period until then. Whatever it identifies as. An evening, a night, a twilight, an afternoon, a morning. We got to get Origin back somehow. I was waiting for Origin to hit me with the dot, 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 question mark. I would... We got to tell Kate, by the way, she's going to be like, where's Origin? We got to tell Kate that Origin got perma banned from the website. <laughs> she's going to be confused. All right, okay. I'll see you in, the, I don't know, 19 hours, something like that. First time chatter. Does this streamer ever talk about the game? You must be new here. Most of the student Twitch streamer, you must be new here. It's rare to witness a, a type of A chatter being born. Crashes, a moderator's dies. The confusion levels heads and go down the new, the new chatter down the hall. Oh, my streamers ranting once again. You know what I'm saying? The confusion levels heads. <laughs> the confusion is a doobie level in heads. To the glory of the high, high, the fetus opens her eyes. The confusion sets in, <laughs> and gives birth to the fetus down the hall. Oh, my fetus setting in again like confusion, thunder leveling heads. Put the fetus at the center of the setting in pale blue colored eyes. 
confusion sets in to the angel down the hall. I know what you're saying. That's, dude, that's a classic from the 90s. That's a 90s classic, without a doubt. 